up YouTube? Thanks for coming to my channel. My name is One of a Kind of Vlogs. If you're new to the channel, like, subscribe, come on, post notifications so that you never miss a video and comment down below. Today we're going to talk about National Sticky Bun Day. Who don't like no National Sticky Bun? Who don't like sticky buns? Okay. What goes better with coffee than something a little sweet, nutty, and possible oozing with caramel? <laughs> yep, you know what we're talking about. February 21st is National Sticky Bun Day. This delightful confection, a Philadelphia specialty original known as Snicken. S-C-H-N-E-C-K-E-N are thought to have been brought to the United States by German settlers in the 18th century. Often served for breakfast, sticky buns are also sometimes known as center buns, caramel rolls, or monkey bread. <laughs> National Sticky Bun Day Timeline. 18th century origins. Sticky buns primarily have German origins known as snicking. 19th century, behold the sticky bun. German settlers like the like the Pennsylvania Dutch bring the sweet treat with them to the United States. 1920s, sweet system. Sweet system. <laughs> the sticky bun system, the cinnamon bun, is created in Sweden. 1954, UBC specialty. Hungarian baker Grace began selling cinnamon buns daily at the University of British Columbia. National Sticky Day activity. Number one, make your own sticky bun. Imagine filling your kitchen with a small, with a smell of species and common bacon in the oven. There are some videos and blogs that help you with technique and the recipe choices are endless. So really, what are you waiting for? Number two, Find the best sticky buns in your city. That's what I'm talking about. We're going to have to find the, the, the hottest sticky buns in our city. Sticky buns are often a staple at, nation, at neighborhood bakeries and brunch spots. Make it a Sunday ritual for checking out all the different options in your city until you find the sticky bun of your dreams. Then shh, don't tell everyone so you can keep them all for yourself. Number three, explore your options. Sticky buns can be made in a variety of shapes and sizes. Create a giant sticky roll that you can slice like a cake. Roll the dough into balls and pile them into a cake pan for monkey bread. Or stack each slice together into a bread pan to create a full pull apart loaf. And sticky buns are only for breakfast. Serve your creation for dessert at your next dinner party. It's guaranteed to be a hit. I tried monkey bread before. Monkey bread's pretty good though. Why we had why we love National Sticky Bun Day? A, hey, they're the ultimate comfort food. The smell of a sticky bun alone makes you feel warm and cozy in this in, in an instant. Whether they are baking in your oven or smell catches you at a local mall, as soon as the familiar scent hits you, visions of fireplaces and pajamas dance in your head. Then as you slowly unroll the doughy goodness, the sugar and spices 
send you to a place of happiness and comfort few other foods can capture. B. They aren't any rules. Sticky buns are fairly easy to make, and there are virtually no rules as to what you can feel on top of them. Warm spices like cinnamon, cloves, and even cardamom are all excellent choices. But you can but but you can feel free to experiment with other fillings such as apple or chocolate. You can also create your own sticky sauce using maple syrup or honey instead of plain sugar. Whatever you choose, have fun and enjoy the stickiness. And C. Enjoy everyone loves them. It's hard to imagine someone not being totally enthralled E N T H R A L L E D with a gooey sticky and C. Everyone loves them. It's hard to imagine someone not being totally with a gooey, sticky, fluffy rolled bun. Most people have wonderful childhood memories of popping open a packet of store-bought dough. The smell of the bacon and the fun of carefully topping each bun with sticky frosting. Like cinnamon, cinnamon, cinnamon bun, same thing. Half of the joy of visiting the traveling fair is hunting down the sticky bun boot and carefully eating their way through the yummy center. Center. Really, if you ever treat, if you ever meet someone who doesn't like sticky bun, be a little worried. Yes, be worried if you don't like sticky buns because everybody loves sticky buns. I want to let you know that. And I want to let y'all know that. Subscribe, like, cut on post all notifications, share me out, comment down below, let me know what you think about sticky buns, because I love sticky buns. And remember, you're too blessed to be stressed, love and happiness at all times, hug somebody, tell me you love me, and always do a random act of kindness. Remember, I'm not going to preach to y'all every time I get on here about random act of kindness. Y'all got to think, do a random act of kindness. I got something coming up for all y'all, all of y'all. Dealing with a random at the time. So you'll be ready. This is about to come out soon. Until then, I'll see you on the next one.